We just mm -hmm. let it segue into the next question. Somebody wanted to know about water and said, uh, should water be uh, resolved, the issue of water, and it's a serious one, should it be resolved separately or should it be a part of uh, land division? Uh, it's very difficult. And the, the, one of the problems is that the, is that the, uh, uh, the, uh, the uh, Israelis have edged a bit into the West Bank with, with, their, with their wall uh, and with their settlements over the major aquifer of the area. And the Israeli, the, action, the, the, the average Israeli settler consumes uh, six or seven times as much water a day or a week or a year as the average, average Palestinian. And the water is very short. The Israelis have uh, excellent engineering work. And that uh, the Sea of Galilee there that I pointed out uh, is the major reservoir of Israel. And they have, they have very excellent, sophisticated water carrier, uh, 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 water, what do you call water carriers anyway, great, great uh, uh, aqueduct. aqueducts that come down and feed water for both for agriculture and for drinking down into Israel. But, but the water is a big problem in Israel, too, a big problem. And some of the aquifers uh, nearer to the Mediterranean are now, are, are, have now been uh, invested by salt so that they're no longer good for drinking. And uh, uh, there's a, a lot of debates with the, with the Syrians over access to the water. And Syria has pretty good rivers. Uh, that's one of the things that uh, they debate about and argue about in giving back the gold on the heights to Syria about how the water would be, would be divided. It's a major problem. 